Uh, this is Shapur from Real Parts. Uh, today in this video, I'm going to uh, show you a practical application of uh, like a demo application of uh, level sensors and pressure sensors and uh, RTDs. So this is the setup that we have here. As you can see, we have two tanks. This is uh, just for demonstration purposes. We have two tanks and with uh, each of these uh, tanks, we have some uh, sort of uh, measurement devices. And I'll start from here at the bottom. Uh, you see uh, the liquid in, into the tank. Uh, this one, this, this sensor is a level sensor that when the uh, like the level of the liquid inside the tank uh, gets to the level of this sensor this sensor sends a signal to the PLC and says okay that the tank is empty this one this one here is a PT100 uh, is, is an RTD uh, that measures uh, the temperature inside uh, this tank the temperature of the liquid you see uh, this is uh, this is how an um, RTD uh, works uh, with uh, measuring the temperature inside uh, uh, like like a tank. And then if we go up here, here we have another uh, level sensor, which when the level of the liquid gets to this point, this is just a switch that sends a signal to the PLC and says that uh, like the tank is full. So we have two uh, level sensors here, one, one here and one at the bottom. So one at the bottom, one at the top, the, at the, the one at the bottom uh, sends a signal. It's just a simple switch that uh, sends a signal to the PLC and says, okay, that's, the tank is empty. And this one uh, sends a signal to the PLC and says the tank is uh, full. Okay, here, here at the top, we have a uh, level transmitter that measures the level for the whole tank. So we had two switches, one at the top and one at, uh, one at the bottom that measures the level of the liquid at each point, like at the bottom and at the top. But this one that we have here measures the level of the liquid inside the tank, like the, uh, the, the uh, as a whole, like the, the, the measure of the whole liquid, not, not just at, at, at some point, and sends the signal from here, the signal uh, send, it sends a signal to uh, the PLC input. And then, on this side of the tank, we have a, a pressure transmitter. You see now that it shows the pressure as a, a 120, and uh, this pressure transmitter uh, pro like measures the pressure inside this tank. When the level of the liquid gets high, uh, the pressure of, uh, here uh, in the tank uh, goes up and down. And this uh, pressure transmitter measures uh, that pressure and then again sends the signal from here, sends the signal to the PLC. So we have another tank so we have two tanks here we have another tank here this one is B1 and this one is B2 and we have the same sort of setup for this tank as well you see we have a uh, here we also have a level sensor that level that, that measures the level of the uh, liquid at the bottom of the tank when, when the level gets uh, really at low uh, at the bottom, this one, this is, this is, this is only a switch. It sends a 24 uh, volt signal to the PLC input and says, hey, the tank is empty. And then uh, we also have another level transmitter. This one, love, uh, like the other one that we had here, this one also measures the level of the the whole tank, not just at a at a point. This one measures the level of the tank at, at the bottom, but this one 
uh, me measures the level of the tank uh, f for the whole tank. Okay, so this was just a simple demonstration of how level uh, sensors, level transmitters, pressure transmitter uh, work. It, it was just a demo. I hope you learned something new from uh, this video. And if you did, please uh, like this video. And if you're not a, a subscriber, uh, please subscribe and hit the bell next to the uh, subscribe button to be notified each time that we put a new video on YouTube. Okay, see you soon.